The American Federation of Teachers is run by Randy Weingarten, one of Hillary Clinton's best friends. In New York City, the nation's largest public school system, about 250,000 members uh, of faculty and staff belong to the United Federation of Teachers, okay? New York City public school system is so big, it needs its own union. You've got the United Federation of Teachers, of which Randy Weingarten used to be president. He then moved over to the American Federation of Teachers, become the president of the national organization, not the largest in the country's New York City uh, union. Here's what gets really, really interesting. You want to see what a mess this is. The United Federation of Teachers in New York City is one of the very few, if not the only place, very few places, if not the only place, where the two biggest, most socialist labor unions, AFL-CIO and the SEIU, intersect. Yeah, they intersect. And here's how. If you're a member of the United Federation of Teachers in New York City, which is controlled by the SEIU, the Service Employees International Union, radically far-left organization, you're a member of the UFT, you're also a member of the AFT, the American Federation of Teachers. Their membership is inclusive of one another. The American Federation of Teachers falls under the umbrella of the AFL-CIO. Think about that for a moment. A quarter million far left radicals in the New York City public school system. I've never met a conservative. I'm sure there's a member or two in there that is a conservative. I've never met them. Let's say 95% of those 250,000 members of the United Federation of Teachers, who are also members of the American Federation of Teachers, those 200 and some odd thousand radical far leftists are the nexus at which the very socialist AFL-CIO and the very socialist SEIU meet. Not a few people in an office. It's hundreds of thousands of members paying dues to both organizations, hundreds of thousands of members who control the largest public school system in this nation, who control education, of millions of students. And in that system alone, they could only achieve a ranking, a ranking out of the 30 some odd schools ranked. Number 11 with 28% proficiency in reading and 28% proficiency in math. You tell me radical far left unions are good for America. This is really important stuff, and I want to bring you the details in depth. So please subscribe to our premium service to watch Off the Cuff Declassified. You can go to www.therebel.media forward slash shows to sign up. Also, go to the App Store, download our Rebel app, and go to firescottisrael.com. Let's get Broward County Sheriff Scott Israel removed from office. Please sign the petition if you haven't already. You've done those things. Thanks very, very much. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.